in this video I share a painting that took me very by surprise and I know I've probably said that before but it's kind of a different surprise each time. I actually just had some excess paint um, in blue hues, a couple of uh, different very pastel bluey green. I was working with some um, lovely mica powders and I had them left over and I just kind of thought well I'm not going to waste them, I'll get another canvas and I just started preparing the foundation of a canvas and I didn't think that I would go back to doing anything on it the same day. I thought oh, I'll just pop it aside but I just felt to sit down and start weaving. That's the only word that I can say. And there were times when I was doing this and I thought, oh, this is just a bit ordinary. It's like, what is this even about? And I wasn't trying to like determine it or define it or like worry about it. But, you know, hours and hours went by and I just became enthralled with its energy and its lightness. And it said to me, when I did this section here, I really had only just done that part of it, but the delicate and particular colors, then it, as it linked into this section, boom, everything came to light. And it said, this is about coming of age, for someone coming of age. Now that's going to mean something different to everybody but it also feels very cathartically connected to Earth and Mother Earth. Now look at it the other way. I was going to say upside down because I have signed it down here, which is where I felt to. But as you know, if you've been uh, viewing many of my art pieces or joining me for the, the ride that this has taken me on as well, you will understand and know deeply that they can be put on the body uh, and in many different directions, uh, viewed from, received from. Now, there is an egg reference here. And as I was painting it, um, I kept getting this sort of visual and sensory experience of Fabergé eggs and how profoundly beautiful they are. And also that um, this is like gazing into a window, a portal, another time. And a lot of my pieces have that energy and that flow or the dynamics is what I can hear my team saying. So this may represent for you a coming home to yourself, a coming of age within your evolution and understanding of why you're here. And of course, we are here just to experience life in all its um ordinary fractals whether we're washing the dishes or whether we're having a big spiritual realization or soul aha or healing something or crying or having anger whatever we experience is part of our human dimension I feel to say now this has got various blues greens pinks metallics lots of gold whites creams and this beautiful sprinklings of mica powders which i'll be um varnishing so uh, as at the date of making this video there's probably about another week f uh, turnaround before it's available for me to post but it is available for purchase so you can um, make inquiries through heart and soul transformations um, on facebook if this does interest you now it's 30 centimeters in diameter and beautiful gold on the side it's going to be varnished uh, in a beautiful satin, so it has a slight gloss. And I'm sealing in these energy codes right now. I'm actually in one of the bedrooms so I can get really nice natural light come in. So if you see the dappled sort of shadows that's just from the blinds but there's just a real prettiness and here's a mirror actually for some reason I this is the first time I've come in here to do a video just to show you the incredible vibrancy of the colors where I live there are um, building houses so there's often peripheral sounds so it determines where I can do a video and then I have a pool filter going for a lot of the day as well. So feeling into your coming of age, your own gestational cycles, your own beauty and your own magnificence, 
coming into a new dutashkarine, uh, uh, eloquence of thriving as you weave and you deliver your seeds of light. There's a connection to all of these sections being seeds of light. This is a very deeply precision based painting. Every little dot, every particular color, eh? especially these sections up here. And this feels very much like two beings, almost like mother and child, perhaps mother earth and we as the uh, seeded child here. There is so much depth to this and it's one of those, those paintings where you can, you know, zoom in and keep looking at it and you'll feel different things and experience different things as you journey with it. Actually, this section here, it's so interesting. I had to change it a little bit because I needed somewhere to sign and there was so much detail. I was like, oh, well, there's nothing, nowhere for me to sign. And under here, there was actually a butterfly, but I wasn't really happy with the way the butterfly was painted. But I love to share with you that there was a butterfly under there because it's still part of the energy of the painting. And I almost noticed this swan... Um, bird-like energy I don't know if that's how you see it but that's how it felt when I was painting it and then there's a little reference of a heart here in the gold the gorgeous powders that have been put through I love that real greeny goldy sort of lime green frequency of it especially when it mixes with the gold Never underestimate your time here. It is valid and it is purposeful. Sicete koreate ruka atarna. Lessons be. Check in the description of this YouTube offering and you'll be able to say see if this is available at the time of viewing. And also you can view all the other videos in the playlist to receive free healing and activations and some of the pieces are already been chosen and some may still be available to purchase. Blessings be. Big hugs. Bye.